What's up, everybody? Furious Pete, Furious Tux. Um, so I just wanted to do a quick little video asking you guys for your opinion because I am beyond frustrated. Beyond. Um, I need a new laptop. So I've had my laptop, this little guy right here, um, for like four and a half years now. Four and a half years? Even more. Almost five years. Um, it has the Intel i5, um, but it's slow. Really slow. Um, what's slow about it is the whole rendering issues, running programs. I actually installed an SSD um, into this laptop about two months ago. And it started, I, I was able to actually run uh, Adobe Premiere on there and um, I was able to actually edit videos. Um, but rendering still takes, like, it takes over an hour for me to render, like, a seven, eight minute vlog. Which is a very long time when you're on the road, because, uh, when I use my desktop over here, um, and I have a seven, eight minute vlog, it takes me, like, ten minutes to render the video. So, the time frame difference is big. It's big. Six times longer to render on the road, and on the road, usually, you want to get stuff done fast and up there and on you go. Now my question is, do I go, there's two options, I've kind of narrowed it down to two options. Um, an Asus, ROG, Rogue, ROG, I don't even know how you want to pronounce it in the whole gaming world, the Republic of Gaming, I think it's called Republic of Gaming, laptop um, uh, versus an Apple MacBook Pro. Um, like when I, I started asking this online and there's so many, you know, Apple fanboys and, uh, you know, people say, oh, Mac's the best and that's it. Um, truth is, like the Asus laptop, the, uh, looking at the exact same price points, um, the Asus laptop is far, far, far more powerful. However, the weight difference is also, is, is the big issue here. Um, so... I can't decide, so there's two, two factors. So I can get, I want something with Unreal Performance, right? Something that I can render, I can run any program on, and possibly game. I'm not a big gamer, but I wanna do more of it. Yeah, it's popular, blah, 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 but I sometimes it's it's good stress reliever whenever I play. Like I have a lot of friends that game, and so sometimes it's, it's a good way to interact, especially on the road. Uh, at home, I can see them, but on the road, it's just a different way, right? Sometimes, sometimes on the road for a while. Um, so I, I would have that option. I would have the option of just running any program, doing anything on the laptop I want to. So, performance, or the fact that it is a travel laptop, and I wouldn't be able, it, it's just two and a half times heavier, or no, like two times heavier. Um, the Asus laptop is 10 pounds, uh, MacBook Pro is like four and a half pounds. So, do I factor that in? I'm a big guy, so I can carry heavy things around, but at the end of the day, it's still one of those things, one of those inconvenient factors. It's also more bulkier and all this other stuff. So, what do I go for? Do I go for maximum performance, or do I go for portability, or do I go for sleekness, or bulkiness, or all that? I want you guys to tell me. Comment box below, and I'm going to decide based on this video, which laptop to get. And I will totally appreciate all the comments because I'm sure there's hundreds of experts out there that are watching this video, hundreds of fanboys of both companies. But I want you to take into account what I just said where, you know, I, I want performance, but I'm also wondering whether the portability aspect of weight should be a more of a priority than, um, the maximum performance. Let me know in the comment box below. I appreciate all your help. I do. I really do. But I really, really do. Catch you guys later. Stay sexy, stay hungry, of course, get late.